Oi Fabricio, I wanted to uh, answer your question. Why, what keeps us from doing the things that we know we're supposed to do? And, uh, you know, you got me, you really got me thinking. I really appreciate that. And I think <clears throat> probably one of the things that keeps us from getting out and doing what we're supposed to be doing would be fear of failure. You know, if we're afraid to, afraid that we're going to fail, afraid that we're not going to make money, or afraid that uh, we're not going to be consistent, or whatever it is with, a, you know, an exercise program, whatever it may be, then um, that can lead us to, to choose to fail. And, or rather to um, to fail by not even trying, not getting started. Um, sometimes we're just afraid, we just don't want to do it. Sometimes we know we should do something and we don't feel like it. And I know for myself, when I sold books door to door, I did it with a group, so I didn't really have a choice. You know, everyone got up and went out and sold books, and that was great. But then when I did it on my own afterwards. I didn't always feel like getting up and going, and so I just had to say, I gotta go do this. I had to balance the uh, pain of getting up and going out versus the pain of not making any money. And when I did, the uh, not making money usually won <laughs> at some point. And so I think that's that can be helpful also to uh, look at the perspective of you have to do uh, decide, you know, which way, what's going to be the results if I do this or if I don't do that. That can help a lot. But uh, if you don't think through that process, it's very easy to just not do anything. Although not doing anything, of course, means that you don't get anything either. So that's my two cents worth. Thanks so much for the video. And I hope I can talk to you one of these days. I'm on your team, you know, or maybe you don't, but I am. And I'd love to, love to talk to you sometime. Take care. Bye.